hello guys welcome back to my channel so guys today we are going to learn about how to update ESX server how to install latest patches so you can see here the version that is showing uh, 6.7.0 update 2 so I am using 6.7 ESX and uh, its update 2 is installed and build number is 13006603 so suppose update 3 is available and if you want to update, update update 3 so first you need to download by going uh, by going to vmware site or you need to search on google to like you you have to enter uh, download vmware esx update so updated version will be uh, display and uh, if you want to update uh, 3 or any other uh, latest patches so download so I have already downloaded here you can see in this format GIF, in GIF format file will be uh, downloaded so now I'll show you uh, if you have downloaded then you need to go to the storage and uh, data store and data store browser and you need to upload that file downloaded file I have downloaded this file so you need to upload this in your data store browser you can see here this is uploaded here uploaded now just close it and uh, one more thing I want to explain here SSS should be enabled you can see here it is showing here disable secure SSS that means it is already enabled because we need to access ESX server through putty through SSH so you need you should have putty now I am going to enter here the IP address of my ESX server that is 10.10.15 10 port number 22 and SSH open here you can see it is asking for login login as root and I have entered password and successfully logged in now so if you want to check here the uh, updated list then you need to enter here ESX CLI software VIV list command and enter so you can see here there are many entries showing after executing after running this command and uh, in the last you can see the update it is showing last updated on 25th March 2013 version is 10 point uh, sorry 6.7.0 and 2 I'm going to clear now here now you have to enter command for patch installation so again you need to enter here ESX CLI space software software viv update space hyphen minus and d slash vmfs slash volumes and uh, data store you need to check here uh, data store name by going storage here, here you can see that it's showing data store one so you need to enter your data store one slash uh, patch file name like I have downloaded this file you can see here ESXi 6.7-231220 so you need to enter here 
द फाइल नेम पेस्ट फाइल नेम लेटेस्ट फाइल नेम विच यू हैव डाउनलोडेड सो लाइक ई एस एक्स आई सिक्स सॉरी सिक्स पॉइंट सेवन हाइफन टू थ्री वन टू टू जीरो वन नाइन and it it is in zip mode so zip either you can enter here or just you can uh, rename and copy or you can also copy from here by going data store browser and select it and copy the name from here copy the name from here and hit enter so i am not going to in, uh, hit in uh, hit here enter because uh, if i'll enter then it will it will be updated it will be deployed and it will ask for uh, reboot and as uh, my another machines vm machines are running on this server so i need to shut down and you need to take care also if you are going to hit enter this so it will it will ask to reboot or successfully update so first you need to uh, shut down your all vms which are running on e your esx server and then uh, hit enter so that it uh, patches will be deployed installed and then it will ask for reboot so you need to reboot your esx server from here uh from here so that means after hit enter here means once you will run this command then you need to shut down all your running vms virtual machines and then you reboot to your esx server so and then uh, after a reboot you can check if your uh, latest patch is deployed or not so just log in your esx console again and you will check here it will be changed like if you have updated uh, version 3 so it will show here 6.6 6.7.0 update 3 and build number will be changed so guys i think now it is clear to you how you can update or how you can install latest patches for your esx server so i hope this will be this video will be helpful for you so request you to please subscribe my channel and if you have any query please leave your comment and like share with your friends thanks bye bye